So what's this? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no. Hey guys, Will back with Royal Canadian Reptiles. Last weekend, we went down to visit our good buddy Will Nussman and we got to pop by Ozzy Boyd's facility. Now, if you guys already know who Ozzy is, he's got some of the craziest snakes on the planet, some of the most orange animals I have ever seen in my life. Before we get into this video, I want to have a little disclaimer out there. Uh, there's no censoring on this video, so there is some profanity, uh, so keep that in mind as you watch it. I honestly didn't even really shoot a video, I just shot a bunch of clips and put them together of while we were there. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy this, Ozzy's got some crazy stuff, so strap yourself in, throw a like on this video, and let's get right into it. Came out with these white tails. Oh wow! I call them white tail boas. Holy, that's so cool. That's, that's an IMG albino Aztec. Isn't that cool? That's you really see the color. Neat. The color. He's yeah. in the shed right now, but when he sheds out, like he has these orange highlights. He's just badass, man. And then uh, I also produced the one with hypo. This is the oh, female. that's pretty. She's a little small. She's had a slow start. But she's that's same white tail. Now. Yeah, and I have that white tail. So the IMG, IMG call strain stuff has been produced before, and it doesn't produce that white tail, but it looks like the sharp strain does. And actually, uh, I thought the white tail was only coming out in the in the Aztec stuff, but I sold the I sold the IMG sharp sun glow to a guy, and he's telling me that that tail is turning white too. Look at that. That's cool. Isn't that crazy? Can you imagine that at nine feet? Yeah. yeah. So this is a hypo IMG, and this is from my red phase of uh, Aztec. Nice. Look at the color on that thing. Check out the tail. Wow. So what's this? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> nah, so... This is from that um, Orange Dream Enchi um, Yellow Belly Fire Leopard. So this one I think is uh, Super Orange Dream. I think it's Leopard. Um, and it looks like it might have uh, Enchi and Fire. Actually, no Fire, Enchi. Super Orange Dream Enchi Yellow Belly probably. But honestly, like some of this stuff, just like, I don't know. Especially when it's high white, it's really, really difficult. But you see, like you saw some of the, see how dark it is over here? Yeah, it's hot. So that one I believe is Super Orange Dream and Chief Fire Yellow Belly Leopard. That's, that's so, so that's nice, so man. Right and that's a male. That color, so, holy. Yeah, so, so just the genetic potential in this snake. Wow. Another one that I don't believe has the fire, so I'm thinking these are Super Orange Dream Yellow Belly Inchy Leopard. <laughs> Got a head on them too, eh? 
Yeah, they all have that crazy head Who pattern. Had? I think that's that's how I uh, determine a leopard. It's too bad they didn't come out more pattern. I guess that was the leopard yeah. that did that. Yeah. This one I think is Super War and Dream and Chick Fire Leopard. That's cool. So when these guys grow up, you know, those males will be for sale. Yeah. <laughs> people always say, hey, when I mail the Yeah. Because people know I sell shit. Like, guys, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll raise stuff up. I'm, I'm not going to mass produce it. You know, this so what's was, this? This was one of my favorites. So this, I believe, to be a Super Orange Dream Mojave, Super Orange Dream Yellow Belly Mojave Leopard Head Clown, and it's Posse Pie, and I think <laughs> it's gonna prove out to be Double Head Clown Pie. Wow, that's impressive. It's not a gorgeous snake. Really, really pretty. My favorite part is how there's like the three distinct yeah. like mm -hmm. zones. Like you have the belly, the black belly, and then you get that crisp yellow, like creamy, and then you have the yeah. dorsal strip. That's crazy. So you see a lot of the crazy shit that I'm producing. It has orange dream and leopard. So the yeah. orange dream leopard stuff, you know, I just think that stuff is insane. I think there's a lot, a lot of potential. You know, one of my favorites from this year. So look at this thing. Holy smokes, man. Look at that thing. Is that an ivory combo? What the hell? No. It almost looks like it's like the leopard ivory uh, on look, steroids. Look how thing. the head, it has that triton. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But it's black. You, you see the, it's black on the head and then down here it's purple. Polka dots, yeah, purple dude. polka dots. Dude, this thing is sick. And you ever, have you ever seen a ringer on the neck? <laughs> it's possible oh, yeah. too. Yeah. Does it have a ringer on the tail as well? They're no. just on the neck. No, on the, the neck. Hell? On the neck, but it has the white pie belly. Yeah. Look at that's that belly. That's crazy. Have you ever seen a belly like that? I mean, how beautiful is that? Dude, that's almost like a bad That's really cool. Coral glow purple on it. Sick, man. Yeah, that's crazy. So this is, uh, I believe, th this was from a um, uh, uh, Super Orange Dream Yellow Belly Enchi Leopard to um, an Orange Dream Mojave Firefly. Madness. Yeah. It's like Dude. when you can line up <laughs> yeah. super yeah. ends. Who knows? So Super Warren Dream Leopard combos is where it's at. Uh, you know, all of the crazy pies I'm producing, they all have that leopard in them. And then like some of this stuff, I mean, oof, you know, and, and forget about the, you know, the clown stuff is gonna be next level too. Oh, that's um, nice. Yeah, so this is uh Warren Dream Batman. Okay, yep. Yeah. So again, you guys see a theme here. You see me chasing the leopard stuff, orange mm -hmm. dream leopard combos. So, right. You know, you can either trust me and follow suit, or you can sleep. <laughs> yeah. Leopard stuff. Is good. But I, I just, yeah, I, I like variety, and I like, I like shit that's going to be unexpected. Produce a lot of unexpected stuff. So. Uh, well, the cool thing about leopard is it keeps contrast in the animal. You know, like it'll. Yeah. Throw, yeah. It'll throw darkness. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah, the orange dream does that too, and, that, and that's what's really, really cool. This snake here, it's just, that's beautiful, man. That's just a lesser leopard that happens to be double head for all terminal clown. Oh, that's it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, lesser leopard. That's really How pretty. How beautiful is that? That's yeah. Really nice. Just a. At first, I thought that was like an orange dream Batman, but it's, mm -hmm. it's just an orange dream leopard spot nose. Yep. Yeah, that looks good. The head clown. Right that's a good looking scene. Yeah, that man. is really nice. So I, I look at this and I, I, I can do a lot without it being clown. I mean, just being head clown is cool. And um, you could do a lot of cool stuff with this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just just the codons themselves work together. Really just, well. just the spot nose clown is, is pretty intense. And here's a. Here's a Super one dream clown. Oh, fuck, that's nice. That's from high intensity bloodline, so it could be double dose or it could be single dose, I don't know. But that's a good looking clown. Super OD yellow belly leopard desert ghost and it's head pie. <laughs> Look how clean that is. Well, maybe it's possible. Super OD Yellow Belly Leopard. It might be Pasta Pie. 
it's a female. I think you got a sibling to this. Yeah, Not you. I think it was you. You actually, I think you got my whole back because the one you bought, I sold or something. I was like, all right, I'll get you. For <laughs> sale. <laughs> Ultra Pied? Ultra Pied, yeah. Yeah, it's nice. It's possible a ghost, but I, I didn't know. I tried to prove him with a head ghost and I didn't get any ghosts. So. Bro. <laughs> I don't even know if this is Orange Dream or what. I, I'm thinking it's pastel orange dream with that jean, but it, it, that's big. And then the puzzle. Look at the sides of that thing, though, dude. It's an S6. Holy! This is some next level puzzle stuff. Damn. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed that. As I told you, there are some crazy things at the facility, and it's just—it's actually inspiring to see how the animals that he's made and gives me a lot of uh, a lot of ideas to bring home to my own collection and hopefully implement them here I uh, hope you guys really enjoyed the video next video is gonna be some RCR stuff we got a couple clutches that are shedding out can't wait to show you guys as always like share comment subscribe we'll see you next week <laughs>